Hey brother, uh, a veteran in the game. Give it up for the one and the only, Mr. Albert Linton, y'all. Albert Linton. One more time for Pedro. Thank you. Thank you very much. And thank you for sticking around. So you have absolutely nothing to do, huh? <laughs> well, thank you for doing that with me. I was just working in the window when you guys came in, you remember me? Sorry. Actually, that was my brother. <laughs> he looks just like me. Sometimes he pisses me off. <laughs> Seriously, thank you for sticking around tonight, because otherwise I wouldn't have anybody to tell these jokes to, and that would be sad. Would someone turn the light off, please, so I won't be confused as to how much time I have. Thank you. So, uh, good to be here. There's nothing wrong with this front row except for two guys. <laughs> yeah, can two women exchange with them? Guys? Can we get that? What about this? What about all the guys get up and move to the back? <laughs> and then all the women move to the front. Can we do that? Can we accomplish that in this moment? <laughs> I'm just crazy for women, man. I don't go to strip clubs. I, I don't. I love titties, actually, but I think they're the greatest thing since titties, actually. Titties are, like, really marvelous. But I don't go to strip clubs because when I see all of those naked women, I just reach in my pocket and pull out all my money. Yeah. You want my money? I get stupid. I get super sad. I'm normally stupid, I get it. But, I think mean, that's what my ex-wife said, that bitch. But, I was like, when I go to strip clubs, I normally lose my fucking mind, man. All those titties that are uncovered. That's like a titty fiesta right there, you know? You're gonna have a big party on, okay, I'm getting carried away. Because Dean said there was like, damn, billions and billions of porn clips on TV. And I've seen every one of them because I don't work during the day. So that's what I do. So, anyway, I heard recently they passed a law in New York making it legal for a woman to breastfeed a baby in public. Did you guys hear about this? Now, this is true. I don't know why they need a law like that because women have been breastfeeding babies forever. I was breastfed as a baby. Were you breastfed as a baby, sir? Of course you were. And you hope you'll be breastfed later tonight, don't you? <laughs> I don't know, man. I see women breastfeeding babies. It don't bother me, but some people got offended about it. And they told the security guard, so he goes over and tells this woman, you can't do that here. You have to go to the restroom to do that. What? When was it the last time you got hungry and went to the bathroom to eat? <laughs> I'd hate to know what the catch up today is. <laughs> Thank you. That's what I was going for. Who needs laughter but you can get it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. The other day I was out shopping because I enjoy shopping. I, not like most guys. Most guys don't like to shop. I do. My favorite thing to do when I'm shopping is stand in front of the store window and fantasize about how the clothes will look on me. And that pisses off the manager at Victoria's Secret, but you know, I do that shit anyway. Because I'm rebellious like that. I like that store because they have those bikini thumb, you know what you're talking about. Got that strap goes up between your butt cheeks. I'm wearing a pair for men right now. <laughs> And the back isn't the problem, it's the front. I feel like I'm wearing an eye patch. <laughs> and it's got to cover two eyes and a nose. But you know, it's a big nose, is all I'm saying. So, so I was shopping, right? And I saw this woman breastfeeding her baby. It didn't bother me at all, but I don't think she liked it when I pulled up a chair. <laughs> Oh my God. I don't know what it was. Maybe it was the drool running down my mouth. I don't know. But she was really pissed off. It's time for me to go. I hate to leave you. I love you so much. You guys are so wonderful. I love each and every one of you. My name is Albert Linton. Actually, my name is Albert Nathaniel Arthur Linton. I don't use it because the initials are A-N-A-L. 
That's Angel from the Slow Folks over there. Thank you. Welcome to the Slow Folks.